click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends. In this particular video, we will learn the very important concept of BJT that is thermal runaway. Mind well, this concept is very important for your Viva perspective. Coming to thermal runaway, the word thermal runaway is showing the fact that due to temperature, some changes happens in your internal circuit of your BJT and due to that, your current voltage parameters can change. See, I know that the relation between IC and IB is with beta. Right? This simple equation I know because beta is nothing but your common emitter current gain where your IC is output current and IB is your input current. But this is not true as practical case. IC is equal to beta into IB plus ICO where we can write this as this is termed as minority charge carrier current as i know that the silicon extrinsic semiconductor is comprises of majority as well as minority charge carriers so if we try to run the majority charge carriers from emitter to collector then in the base region as well then in the base region as well there are minority charge carriers as electrons and these leads to have the current flow which leads again in the form of collector current increment. So I can say IC is comprises of beta into IB plus ICO and this ICO is in the two ways. One is ICBO and ICEO. Collector to base current when emitter is open, collector to emitter current when base is open. Here ICO, we are considering it as minority charge carrier current. Now, a simple fact when learning the thermal runaway is temperature dependency. As the property of ICO is saying, ICO As a property of ICO, ICO gets double ICO gets doubled for every 10 degree rise in temperature. Mind well, consider example. This ICO generally in the terms of nano ampere 10 to the power 9 very very less. So generally we neglect this value of ICO but don't neglect when we are increasing the temperature beyond your normal temperature. So if we are taking example of ICO initially ICO 1 is equal to 10 nano ampere right if it is 10 nano ampere after 10 degree rise in temperature temperature plus 10 degree right so here we will write it as at temperature t t plus 10 degree ico2 will become 20 nano ampere for next t plus 20 will be getting 40 nano ampere and so on will be getting 80 nano ampere and so on so this is how we'll be getting increment in your ic so this increment in ic can lead to increase the value of collector current dc collector current that is ic now we will learn the fundamental of this current voltage relationship which is important for your thermal runaway we can say that as temperature increases right as temperature increases then i know that from the property of ico ico increases right and this increment is
ICO increases. This ICO increment leads to increase in the value of IC, right? IC increases, right? As IC increases, because we have know that IC is equal to beta into IB plus ICO. The effect of increment in the IC is nothing but on power. So you can say that your power is equal to VCC multiplied by IC where your value of VCC is constant. If this is constant, then I can say that your value of power increases. If power increases, if power increases, 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 I can say that power dissipation increases. And somewhere this power converts the energy in the form of heat energy. So I can say here, will be getting increment in the heat. Now we are starting point and ending point is same. Temperature increases that's same as that of your heat increases. So if heat increases cycle gets repeated as heat increases your temperature increases and that leads to increment in the value of ico ic power dissipation heat and so on this cycle go on increase and increase and increase and this end point which leads to damage your bjt heat up your BJT and that's why we have to take care the thermal runaway parameters for your design perspective. This is very important question for your Viva purpose. Thank you so much for watching this particular video. I hope you have understood the funda of your thermal runaway. Thank you so much. We will learn more and more conceptual ADC1 along with you along with Ikeda videos. So subscribe Ikeda video channel. Thank you.